All right, guys, good morning. Good, good morning. Good morning, good morning. Woo, the mountain is active today, guys. As you see, we got Uber loaded. We got the collar on Domino. Domino going to see his uh, grandma. You're going to see Bitty Boo, ain't you? All right, guys, we're going to go drop Uber off at the doctor because she is sick and her medical insurance is about to run out. <laughs> so we're going to go get her dropped off so I can get it fixed for free. We got a little squad on her. A little squad on her. We also got the old Blue Eddie uh, loaded up. We're going to do a little bartering today. Wait until you see what we get. Come on. All right. Uber is at the doctor's. Extreme work and play here in Oklahoma. Uh, I always got to be careful, guys, here because uh, I want everything they got. Everything. <laughs> Look at that big old sexy. It's one thing I do regret with Uber. I wished I would have went ahead and got the cab, although I probably would have broke all the windows out by now. <laughs> but I would like to have the cab for those colder months. Uh, let's go uh, talk to these people and get Uber unloaded because uh, this is just the beginning of our trip. We're going to military bases to go see MT Homestead and all kinds of stuff. Domino, how's your trip? Domino's happy. Gary, you good? Oh, yeah. All right, let's get Uber unloaded. All right, guys. Say hi. Hi. These guys here at Extreme Work and Play are taking care of me again and taking care of Uber. Uh, She's been beat up. It's time to uh, give her to the doctor, let her get serviced. We're going to get her unloaded, get all the numbers and stuff off of it, drop it off with these great people right here. And then I got to get my butt further into Oklahoma to go to the military base to get some more supplies. Come on. You know, it's a lot of money for it to be just sit there and be a yard ornament. So I use it. Yeah. Thank 
Danke. Sometimes you just, you know, you never know when you need your old cast iron. Come on. <laughs> All right, guys, whenever I was doing the uh, chicken hoop coop move for Jeff, I lost a barren buddy there, and it's an odd size. So I bought this trailer from these guys, and he happened to have one in his office. And I had to use a cast iron skillet to put it on. Much as I got in that guy. Probably ain't much more grease on that one. <laughs> I think you were out on this guy as well. Nope. Well, that'd be the last time that that one right there is used, anyways, because old Pops got me an electric grease gun. And I'm excited about using that. Well, you got some grease in there. Right? Yeah, we, we got a little bit of lube in there. <laughs> I tell you what, I really love these guys here at Extreme Work and Play, man. They always take care of me. They, they really look out for me and I do a real, real good job. So if you're ever in Potus, Oklahoma, and you need side-by-sides, lawnmowers, tractors, you name it, these guys got it. All right, guys, let's continue on to go see MT Homestead. Come on. All right, guys, just got out of Harbor Freight. Went in and got some straps and stuff for all the goodies that we're about to get. And dropping Domino off for a play date. Yeah, he's gonna visit with Nana for a while. And then we're gonna meet him over there at Old Bitty Boo's Homestead after we get done with MT Homestead here at the base. Uh, we got more stuff to load up there. It's gonna be a busy, busy one, guys. Domino, be a good boy. Say I will. Be a good boy. Be a good boy. Have fun. McAllister. Hey, well, thank you. <laughs> we're gonna go ahead and show you Big Mike right now because where we're about to go, there is a no-no with no cameras. Come on. Mm -hmm. yeah. yep. Um. So y'all see an empty trailer, and when we get done, you'll see a full trailer. Right. All right, guys. See you in a minute. All right, guys. Didn't get a chance to uh, talk to y'all at the base, but look at all the stuff that we got. Barrels on barrels. Three pallets of concrete. Now we're over here at Bitty Boo's, loading up the Harley. Took a little while to get that sucker crunk right there. But uh, yeah, we're gonna try to load that Joker's heavy. Heavy! Yeah. <laughs> and we had to fight to get that out too. Let's see how this works.
She may be tiny, but she works. Hey, she'll get her done. I can drive anything. <laughs> You know, we got over here and she said, you know, I ain't had this tractor crank in about two years. And I don't remember how I was told to crank it, but we got her to run, come up. That saved us right there. That junk is heavy. That hardly, guys. It's got cast iron heads. Yeah, that joker is a lot heavier than what it looks. Let me tell you what, it was a, it was a mission. But we got it, hey, we got what we came for, so that's awesome. So now we need to give you a blue eddy. It ain't light either. <laughs> uh, I gotta get that breather deal put back on there too, so dark dollars don't uh, get in that. The screw is. Oh, that's why. Get the screw out of the center. There you go. It's a nice little yard trick. It, reminds it's me of my gonna be good for what I want wanting to do. It reminds me of my little uh, Kubota I had there in Florida. But did you see those little bitty implements in the carport over there? Yeah. I'll show you what they go to. Alright, I need to strap that down. We need to get air in the tires. And I need to take some pictures and stuff and look at the tires on that horse trailer. Because... I, I need to know if I need to get tires before I come back to get it. Okay. Those, those. Well, Domino's enjoying his little visit. He's hanging around with all the other doggies. Look at him strutting. Peeing on all the tires. Yeah. He's thinned out a little bit, huh? Yeah. <laughs> chasing the, chasing what, Uber. Though, the way he grabbed those two burgers up today was funny. Pond looks a lot cleaner than the last time I was here. Uh, we still got a lot of work to do for it. It's coming along though. Domino! Domino! At least you can walk what are you down doing? here now without breaking your neck. Yeah. I just did a little bush hogging myself. What we got, what we got, what we got. She needs a little work. Needs a little work. She's got to be cleaned out. Like I said, I don't know about the floor. Yeah, floor ain't no big deal. Put a new one in there if you have to. And I have no clue what all he's got thrown in there. To, yeah, it's going to have to have a floor. All right, guys, we're loaded up, strapped down. Got the Harley good to go. A lot more good to go. All the concrete good to go. The barrel's good to go. The other barrel's good to go. You got Betty Boo, her blue Eddie. Now all we got to do is uh, get Domino loaded up and head back to arkansas see y'all back on the mountain good morning guys well we made it back to come on mountain last night probably about 8 30 it was dark and we was wore out that was a long day we left at about 6 30 got back at 8 30. whole lot of work a whole lot of driving but we made it home good with everything intact now I'm heading over to the 41.36. We're going to go ahead and unload these pallets. I'm going to leave my pallet over there until I get Uber back. And then uh, I plan on taking Uber over there and fixing their road. So when I go and do that, I'll pick my pallet up while I have Uber. But it's the smarter move for me to go ahead and do that while there's three of us to unload it instead of me having to unload one of them all by myself. So we're all just going to work together and unload all three of them. All right, let's head to the 41.36. Come on. We made it. I'll film you too. Come on. <laughs> come on. Come on. Come on. Hey. How's it going, man? Tired. Tired. Oh, yeah. But we're here, and we got a big project ahead of us. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, I'll bring y'all back whenever we uh, enter this nightmare. 
all right guys the moment that we've all been dreading it's go time let's get an assembly line going and break our backs let's get it is a wrap the harley is strapped the concrete is covered our backs are broke yeah you're a beast you're a beast you're a beast he's a beast he's a beast gary saved my life guys with the wrist brace it's got a metal bar in there as y'all know if y'all been following my wrist is kind of messed up and also i have a tennis elbow on top of it so basically this right arm is just decoration and that Portland is a uh, 92.5 pounds. Come each. on, each. How many of those do you suppose? Was 32 in, in each pallet. So how many pounds is that? So that is 66. 90. Oh, how many? Oh, 90. 9900 yeah. pounds. Yeah, 9900 pounds. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. Let's do the maths, cause I ain't good at that math stuff. We said it was 90 point what? 32 bags of, 92. of pallet. So yeah. 32 bags. So it's 9,600. 96. 9,600 6. pounds. Times 92.6. 92.6. To be exact, folks. Times 35. It is 8,889. 8, yeah. That's a whole lot of what's happening. Mm -hmm. I tell you what, though, guys, this is a lot easier with three people than it would have been for one or two. You know why? Why? You know why? Why? Because we're the three best friends that anybody could have. We're the three <laughs> best friends that <laughs> I think we should make more friends. <laughs> right? If we had ten best friends that anybody could have. And we'll never, ever, <laughs> ever, ever, ever leave each other because we're the best. <laughs> uh, guys, if we can still laugh and joke after unloading all of that. We really are the three best friends that anybody can have. Come on, come on. <laughs> oh. All right, guys, me and Gary's going to load up in the truck and we're going to go drop the Harley off at the Harley Fix It guy because uh, we both decided as heavy as that is, we want to take it off the trailer broken and load it back up running. <laughs> yeah.
right. Yeah. Right. <laughs> 100% on that one. All right, guys, we'll see you at Magazine Tire. He's excited about the project. He said it's gonna be a fun little project. He likes it, it's cool. Huh. It's definitely not like something that I'm gonna make money on or nothing like that, but it'd be a cool little project, I think. Maybe something I can pass down to my son one day. Let him play on it in a little while once I decide to get something a little more comfortable. Mm -hmm. All right guys, true value, here we come. We made it back to Come On Mountain. We're fitting a park this trailer and then go ahead and get these barrels out and get the animal feed in there and stuff we got a big storm coming in here tonight so we got some stuff we need to batten down the hatches before the rain hits mama how you doing mama What are you doing, Coco? What are you doing? Got the cute little babies over there snuggled up together. These guys are gonna get them some evening groceries. What's going on, little man? What's up, young lady? Oh yeah, five steps and need to take a break, huh? Coco, what are you doing? Are you still in hay? Are you still in hay? You need to get your butt back in the pen.
Look, buddy. All right, everybody's fat and happy. Old Coco's eating. All the other goats are eating. Babies are still over there napping. Everybody's got food and water. Old Gandalf here is looking all beautiful. Now we got to carry one of the uh, barrels over there by the chickens and carry the chicken feed over there and feed and water them. Well, that's something I've never been able to do is actually pull my truck back here. Making progress. Chickens are good to go. They're in a feeding frenzy. Uh, that's one of the next things I got to do right there. Now that I got the bathroom and kitchen done and got this trip over with, it is time for me to build some nesting boxes for the girls here. They are producing though. And the one is got about 30 eggs over there she's sitting on. Which I don't mind right now because I'm so busy right now. I don't really have time to deal with the eggs. So I'm going to give her a chance to hatch them. Alright. Let's get Eclipse fed and Domino. We're almost done. Hey baby girl. What you doing? What you doing? You happy see daddy? I've been gone all day, huh? I've been gone all day. Let me get you some food. What are you doing, buddy? What are you doing? Oh, you muddy feet. No, don't jump on me with your muddy feet. What are you doing? You coming? I love animals, guys. They're always happy to see you. Okay. Midnight, are you just following me everywhere? Huh? You've already got food. You've already got food. We'll play in a minute. Let me we'll put this food up. You've already got food. There you go, Domino. Whew! been a long two days guys but we got it all done uh, we had a safe successful trip i want to give a big shout out again to mike and terry over there at mt homestead appreciate it a ton guys uh looking forward for the next trip biddy boo homestead biddy boo brown homestead uh, thank you so much love you uh, great trip can't wait to come back but I am exhausted and Eclipse is ready for her evening walk. She is fired up, guys. So I'm going to take her on a walk before it starts raining today. Everybody is healthy here on the mountain. Love every single one of y'all. And until we see each other again, come on, let's go on another adventure. Hey.